Play Store. Compre, venda e faça upgrade de skins com os melhores preços do Brasil. Acesse agora playstore.com. Two versus two. Three kills for Forrest. Looking to possibly close map one on the ace, but Plopski gets into the mix. Cold Zera's up above on low health and a five second defuse not stuck. Oh! But Cold gives him a second chance. Plopski trying to get this final kill. Now sticking down the bomb. Two seconds and he has to come off again. That's it. It is not over yet. Ninjas giving FaZe their ninth. Defender is Cold Zero. He's ready and waiting. Picks up one. Here's the bomb. He's already going to clear out the second. And now it's left all on to Cirque. Surely there's nothing he can do. Cold with the hold. Three on three make that a three on one. Cold Zero now, along with the Krieg in a one versus two. A little bit of wall bang coming in. Not really distracting him that much. And he sees the second player. He'll take down Ethan as well. And now it's a one on one. And surely Breeze is going to be a little bit worried. Cold slightly lower in health. The flashbang does really nothing. There's a follow up one if he needs it. But yeah, Breeze, he wishes that he's going to get an angle here. And Cold Sierra, he's looking at it perfectly. A one versus three being won here by the Brazilian champion. Got to find this kill as soon as possible here for FaZe. Oh, Satares, how does he get away with another? Cold eventually there with a trade. But now he's getting wrapped. Now the time is working better for Big. And Tizian is in the back line. And that bomb is just out in the open. Even having to untuck yourself an inch here if you're cold, Zara, is scary enough, let alone the couple of feet to that bomb. Sneak back onto it, and he will be allowed to pick it up. Anticipates that there's players nearby, and Smuya is holding the cross with the orb. If he slow peeks this next angle, he could risk going down instead. Ooh. Tries to check the flank, and he will find Tizian. Now, Smuya, 1v1, and cold Zara on the other side. Cold timing is everything Ooh, here, and it feels no. like he's got an idea. Oh. Smooya on the angle, but he'll get deleted. Surely not. Miko's in a good angle here. Shots an RPK will try and dispatch him. No, it's Zai Wu that takes the initial peak. RPK now has that AWP, but he puts the P250 to good use. As now the attention turns to Cold Zero, and of course it does. Three kills and oh. make it a four. First line of defense, and he's using the smoke to his advantage. Oh, they're already in CT, but Cold one step ahead, very aware, and he's very much tuned in now, Ooh. almost a third, misses it by a hair's length, Brokey will get dealt with, it's Cold though, and it's the Cold show, because he'll get four, phase 15 rounds, and a smile on that man's face. Uh, or like triple, yeah. but there's Molotovs, etc. You can throw for all of that, right? So, oh dear. Yeah, but this round is just the mop up, and it is that and more. It's also the round that Cold Zero gets his ace denied. A 14th round for Phase. Died. Yeah, that is a little bit of a giveaway. Now they're going to try and see if they can show the peak it up. Cold Zero, though, you're going to have to get up really early to catch him with that kind of a maneuver. Broke key. Boost it up here, Glaive, that's a lot of angles for him to cover. He's still pressing the issue, and that's a problem. There's even a rotation coming into the perfect time here. Nico, he'll only get the one kill, but there's 40 seconds left. And Cold Zero, one more pickup with the AWP, and now they're in trouble. Astralis here. Sip, it's a nice boost, but a nice kill, and Dupree trying to manage that angle. They'll actually get that one, too. Two on two with 25 seconds left. No bomb hunt yet. And a nice shot from Rain. That makes all the difference. Cold Sierra ending up with three kills in the round and shutting down that. Putting on this bomb site, Boomich flies past the flames and then only gets himself a single kill. Simple, tucked away with doors closed. And Cold Zera has to ask himself, does he look towards Bomb or go on for the duel, which he wins? And Electronic, a lights out performance on Dust 2, can do nothing in the 14th round. Seven apiece. Landing for Nico. Kagan's got to deal with the monster play now. Ash is coming over, and Nico's already gone. Kagan just pivoting on the pillar, not giving them an opportunity. But as the smoke blooms, Cold Zero comes around the back line. Bomb in his hand. He wanted that plant. He didn't know Rops was so close, but he hasn't got a choice. Faking it out. Ballsy play, but he needs the kill immediately. He gets it. And even if he can find the follow up, there's just no time for the round. Nice shots from Cold Zero, but frankly, they are inconsequential. Ivy, always uh, a favorite, it seems, on pistols and train. And we'll see whether or not Cold can make his way down. Pop, alrighty then. That's not really supposed to happen. Snatchy, he's dropped oh the ball. Oh my god. And Cold Zero. Oh. Nice. And there's another smoke to come. Broke doesn't have the best angle for it, though. And here comes the push from. One place made his way towards CT. Broke, you have to get more from that. Wasn't able to, though. 
Colder has been spotted at the back of the site. No one is anywhere close to him. He's got 13 seconds to try to hold on. The bombs on the floor need to be collected. Big are oh, super slow, but right over the great to get the flashbang in time. There it is. There's a the flashbang. There's the peak. There's the kill. There is no plant to be had. The first one was stolen, and everything turns around. Cold Zero is the last man standing. He's been dangerous for FaZe. He has the bomb in his sights, and he's got himself a one versus one. PHR re-peaks, and that will make things harder. There's a deep smoke. They've got a flash. They've got a molly. Cold Zero will keep pressing forward. The molly goes too deep. It's too late. He's got another one v1. But he's down to the USP versus Mihu, who's on a P to 50 and 15 HP. In the smoke is Mihu. Cold Zero moving around. Does he realize what could be possible? I think he does. Through the smoke will be Mihu, but that's the end of that. Cold Zero 1 versus. That's massive. If Astralis take that, Talon take this, that's where we get the really interesting scenario. But this is a very important round. It's the CZ, the B Rush, and all the damage you like. Nico and Cold Zero doing absolute work here. That's going to be the round. It's going to be map and indeed match points here for FaZe. A chance to draw, though. That's all Cloud9 can really hope for. It's just going to be Daps turned into a corner. A round they were destined to win. Remember, if they... Oh, nice yeah, that that's a problem. It's a big stack towards the A site, basically. And FaZe was running a really fast running play in towards top mid. The smoke from cold to arch from second mid. You don't see that all the time. But here he is on the flank. Easy kill into Xantaris. But now they know where he is, and he doesn't know where Nex is. Nex is... On that angle, he's on that Krieg, the headshot position. Next has every advantage here. But he's got to get the shot, and for s some reason, he. They have confirmation that Brokey's there, but they do not know about Cold Zera. And he's crouching, he's creeping, he's crawling, he's closing this distance, and he's going to have to close the 1v2. Cover of the box from Lecro, who does still look for the fourth, but no, sir. Retake solid. Cold with a kick. What I said. Why is I really that? want to back pedal. I think they're going to lose now. That's oh. why. It's a one for one. Could be worse for Vitality. Looks like it'll push, be a peek into short. Push on short. And from Con as well. You can't miss that. So he doesn't get punished for it. And it draws enough of a distraction that RP's at. RPK is able to get some work done. But he continues the push. Cold Zero. No way. How has he done that? Get. Cold. Oh. This time, he's got the shots. This time, he's got the kills. Twist answers, but Froki's there to trade. Finally. Even 3v3 on the A site. A little bit of a short shelf push. Anticipates the peak from Rez. And then doesn't even fall off. He knows they've got the numbers oh. advantage, and he has got some pristine aim today. That is three kills for Cold Zero. Make it four. Phase taking back their lead. They gave up five in a row, Mohan, but now they're looking a little more comfortable. My favorite part of the players quickly coming through upper dark, but Cold Zero should be able to hear this. They're not slowing down, they're stopping. And Olaf, he was out in the open, so Cold had to be aggressive. He at least has a 1v1 that he's won. And now against Nav, the op misses its mark. Nafly hasn't come through. And Cold Zero just waiting patiently. He knows what's coming next. And Naf is trying to just delay a little bit longer to make Cold Zero question it, and he's got another win. A oh. solid round from Cold Zera and Yanko's hyped up. Oh, that's that TT spawn as the third man now, and Cold Zera, he knows he's got to do something aggressive. You can't sit and be reactive now, so he will take a forward position. <gasps> he takes two and the bomb. There's plenty of time, but that is a colossal collateral to double C. Oh, oh man. Ouch. For Brokey, Cold Zera, however, on short, remains unchecked. And while the bomb does go down, Vitality are dropping like flies. Alex has himself an SG. He'll be the danger man here, but RPK somehow gets one with a P250. And Rain is on 6 HP. A feasible round now for Vitality if RPK and Alex can step up. He gets a nice angle onto Cold Zero. Doesn't hit the shot, though. And Rain falls. That bomb is ticking oh. quickly. But Cold Zero coming out from mid, and that has so many players dedicated to this position. Molotov going down, Nico flashing his team out. Zaiwu, the first man to try and pull away from this quad setup, and he will get a kill. Oh, it's actually RPK stealing it away. Now Zaiwu comes up to the line, he gets one, nothing done. Olaf and Cold trading back, and that is a done round. That was all over the place. Zaiwu actually doesn't get a single kill, despite it looking like he has two. Smoke arrives on short, but already the charge is going to be... Led from Monster, Golden does find the first head and he's not stopping there. Brokey caught on short, finally silenced, but the damage dealt. Just Nico and Cold Zero, that's a quick one. And another opportunity, Dinks flush towards Graffiti, bombs going down. Putting that P250 and Kevlar on Cold seems to be making a whole lot of sense in hindsight. Looking for a two versus five here. Nico and Cold up against it all.
on him from heaven. Nico patrolling. They're taking their time. The kit's on Kriaz, and so they do have that luxury. Now they start their advance. They'll use Flusher to draw fire. Nico finds the head already. Kriaz gone. That's the kit they'll have to retrieve. And Flusher dies on that retrieval mission. Incredible between the two of them. Nico and Cole, 2v4. Look at the time. There's only 30 seconds left. This late smoke could actually cause some problems. And yeah, you can see they're just going to opt to execute through it. But Rocky caught out a little bit in terms of space. That Molotov's done so much damage, though. Cold with the UMP has gone huge in this round. Even retrieves an AK for his troubles. And with 15 seconds left, they still haven't cleared the man at the back of the side. Rocky is well aware, but he may not even be near it. The Brazilian just going ham. Five kills, an ace total. And wow. He's to come back, and FaZe Clan need this to like solidify. I mean, uh, a potential map victory. Third map of Mirage. Keep themselves alive in the tournament. Oh dear, I don't think they expected that many people to be in the corner. Cold Zero! He's the snake in the grass. The three men spray down. Phase R, double stacked on the site. Info and the shot for Nuki. It's cold alone in the clutch. He hits a shot, but he's down to 10. If he can just stay alive, if he can just get away from this gunfight, it might be enough, but he forces it instead. And wonderful stuff from Cold Zero. This was just monstrous. To correct that second one, Olov even chimes in with another, and then the third is just that little bit of extra spam. Either outside of the B site. And Brokey's got this MP9. There isn't a smoke for CT, so Ooh. you're flashing in. You're trying to get by, and they will actually deal with him. Cold has been so oh. good over oh. an emo, and he's not feeling emo right now. Instead, he cuts down. Eyes glow like two fires, movement so graceful. Wildcat in the jungle with dangerous claws. Movement she anticipates, a side is set on her prey. Like stars in the darkest night, crystallized.